we looked at different locations because we had to add quite something that was being able to be seen from space. So we ended up writing this message that is about one and a half times the size of Central Park in New York City. So the main challenge was the scale of it. And we took weeks laying out and drawing the GPS and pretty substantial crew to make sure that the drivers would know where to drive. That was a challenge, the scale of it. Yes, we needed a large uh, dry lake bed, and we scouted this location about three times, the Del Mar dry lake bed in uh, Nevada, and uh, they had the best conditions for us to lay out our message. The method of lasering that we used for this project was a global positioning system and GPS, basically, and we used satellites to locate um, the perimeter, and then we place the image that we were trying to project and then just lay it rotated in place and went out and laid it out once we obtained the GPS coordinates of what we needed to wear. This project, when it unfolded, it was the first I was first approached about it. it was, uh, the concerns were heavy. There was, uh, there was a huge demand uh, to do these types of things with precision, um, endurance in the vehicle, its agility, its handling, uh, nimbleness, and uh, the genesis was the, was the final selection. And I, I couldn't compliment the vehicle anymore. We're perfectly out here. I think the field is just an absolutely desolate location, and uh, the heat, the terrain, it's, uh, it's quite difficult. And the vehicle holds up to all of its uh, statements. ask for a great bunch of guys to be with me, you know, it's just, it's family, it's team, it's fun, it's wonderful. Vu les possibilités de pluie, les possibilités de vent, il était très important de pouvoir effectuer en continuité toutes les prises de vue nécessaires dans un temps très limité. D'où le grand nombre de caméras, le grand nombre de dispositifs, de moyens techniques qui sont en Il a été utilisé en hélicoptère, système shot over, une voiture traveling uh, HCAM, le système de stabilisation caméra type UV Free Fly, plus euh, les caméras standard. This is a huge project. It's uh, bigger than anything I've seen before. The scale of the drawing and everything we're doing here. And we don't want to let step him down, so we're holding this off. Can't have any weather coming up. It rains, the wind blows, the whole message can get erased and we won't be able to see it from space. So. It is very rewarding to have worked on it for so long and to have involved so many people. Everybody just gave them heart, passion. And at the end, to see Stephanie and her father bringing a smile to their face is very, very rewarding. This was an official Guinness World Records title attempt for the largest tire track image. I mean, would have been blew out of the water with an incredible achievement. What's even more amazing is seeing it take shape in person over such a large 